All right. How's everybody doing? This is a new series on Midwest Horizon. Uh, this will be episode one. And I'll continue to do my other series on Huron County. But we're going to do this one as well. So, so what's going on is for here, I ended up buying a old cattle ranch on, on an online auction. And basically... We are moving to Midwest Horizon to start our new life. Um, all I brought in was what I could fill in my saddlebags and my bike. And basically, this is our new hometown. So I did land a job also. So I got in touch with a, uh ad I saw about needing cattle ranch hand. And I applied talked to the owner for a few days here and there and he liked me and gave me a job so we're gonna go check in at the uh, at my new employer and we'll uh, see about finding a place to sleep for the night and then uh, hopefully we can go check out my new cattle ranch that I bought the only issue with the cattle ranch that I did buy though is we can't move in yet because it's we can't get to it. It's got like an unsafe bridge and an unsafe road that's being fixed. So once that's fixed, we can uh, move in and take control of the property. So, we'll, so I don't know how long that'll take. Hopefully it won't take too long. Yeah, this is a this is a nice area. Lots of farmland, lots of farms. Okay, so I know that the uh, the cattle ranch I'm going to be working for is somewhere up here on the left. I believe it's this one up here on the left right here okay looks like a big bump coming up whoa that is a big bump okay yep that's to be the place okay Let's see where do I pull in ah right here okay Okay, this is the place. It's a pretty nice cattle ranch. Okay. So I have the gate code. Yep, gate code works. Alright, so he told me to go up to the house and see about finding him around there in the shop somewhere and see what's going on. Alright, let's see if I can find somebody. Hello? Oh, there's somebody. Okay. Okay. So a very nice guy. He told me that employee parking is over here or by that little white shed there. So we're going to go park in the employee parking. He said I'm free to use anything that has a key in it. Um, basically what my job's going to be is feeding and watering all the animals. That's what he needs. I guess the last person uh, ended up moving away and he needed that position filled and 
that's what I got. So that'll be some good experience for me since I uh, bought a old used cattle farm. So get some real life cattle farm experience. That'll be nice. Okay, so this is the employee parking. That guy gets paid pretty well, I think. That's a nice car. Okay. So let's go take a look around the ranch and see what's going on. Let's go check out our uh, our new animals that we're feeding. Okay, so let's go this way. So I do see a lot of hay and a lot of grass. Oh, whoops. What was that? I heard something. Oh, that's a pig. Oh, I guess we got some pigs. Okay. Got some pigs on the farm. Ooh, don't want to wreck my new employer's uh, vehicles. We got some sheep. Okay. Let's head on over here. Let's take a look at this cattle over here. Oh, okay. Got a bunch of limousine cows over here. That looks like the uh, water system they got going on for watering the animals. Okay. Let's go see what they got over here. Like a feed trailer. And some more Angus cows. Oh, here's a couple nice trucks. Wow, those are pretty. Nice Peterbilts. A grain trailer and a cattle trailer. Okay. Oh, they even got a helicopter. Wow. This guy must be doing pretty good for himself. I mean, you own a helicopter. I mean, you gotta be doing good. Okay, well, let's go uh, talk to the boss. I think I've seen enough. Very happy with my decision to come work here. So let's go see where we can... Uh, find a get a good night's sleep yeah all right let's see what he's got to say okay he said that there's a cattle ranch hand purse place over there in the red barn that we could sleep at and then uh he said, well, I can start working in the morning. And he said he'll even uh, take me to look at the uh, cattle ranch I bought. He actually knows the old owner. So, that'll be kind of exciting. Okay, so I'm going to park this out here and get a good night's sleep. And then uh, we'll start our new our new day. All right. Good morning. So here we are, first day of work.
Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and uh, start feeding the animals. And I think we'll try that Kubota over here. So I guess it's when I'm done with my work, he said he's gonna take me up in the helicopter and show me around the town. That sounds like it'd be exciting. Okay. All right. Some pretty nice equipment. Okay, so I think we'll start with feeding the cows. So let's go ahead and get some hay here. Okay. We got some hungry cows right here. Looks like they're still eating a little bit. And there it goes. Good. So we'll head over to the other side and feed the brown ones. Okay, so we got some hay bales here. Let's go ahead and I guess we'll grab one of these. Okay. Gotta get used to using our front loader. Nope, didn't even get in there. Okay. There we go. There we go. Okay. So we're going to give these cows some food. And then we will go see about feeding the sheep and the pigs. And then we'll see about giving water. And then we'll go talk to the boss. Okay, so I think there's some pig food down here, and I see some grass bells for the sheep, so okay. Should be okay. So let's go ahead and let's go feed the sheep real quick. Okay. A little bit of a tight little fit here. There we go. Okay, come on, get in there. There we go. Well, it appears the sheep's food is full. But that's okay. Just gonna scoot a little closer. There we go. All right, let's go see about feeding the pigs. Okay, this should work. A little close to the fence, but... Oh, 
Well, not so well. Okay. That's okay. We will find a better way. Okay, so the pigs, actually, there's only two of them. And they're pretty full on food right now, so I really don't have to give them anything at the moment. I'll have to see if I can find uh, some better pallet forks somewhere here on the farm. Okay, so now... Let's see if any of these animals need water. Okay, so we're going to hop in the little vehicle here. Alright, this is a lot of work. So I believe we're going to take that red truck and go check all the water troughs. Okay, let's park right here. Okay. Okay, so the tank's full of water already. That's good. Okay. It's a pretty nice setup. Okay. Well, they're taking quite a bit of water. Wow. Okay. So let's get some more. All right, let's get this thing as close as we can. And we're filling. Okay. I have to say, I am pretty excited to go up in that helicopter. So I think on this one we'll fill the... No, we'll fill the pigs and the sheep first. Be a little tough to feed the or water the sheep with all this stuff here. Let's push this forward a little bit. There we go. And let's see if we can get this in here. Um, not so well. Okay, it does look like they have plenty of water. So the sheep aren't using much yet, since there's not very many of them. So I'm kind of thinking the pigs won't need water either. But we'll see. We'll try it and see. And nope, they do need some water. Okay. Nope, barely any. Okay. So we'll just give this to the cows. So I'm sure they're going to need it. Yep. <coughs> there we go. Cows are watered. 
Okay, so all the animals are... Oh, nope, we got one more over here. I forgot about the ones in the back. Alright, let's get some more water. And I'm going to need to go see about feeding them real quick. We'll do water first, since we're already in the water truck. Okay, we are filling. Okay, it sure is a nice truck. Okay, so let's go see what their levels are. I think the water's on this side. Yep, right here. Okay. So they're taking quite a bit of water also. So for these these ones here, he said he wants me to use the feed trailer to feed to yeah to feed these ones because I don't know something different about these. He's he's more interested in these cows for some reason. So I don't know what his plan is with them, but hey, he's the boss. I'll feed him the way he wants me to feed him. So we'll go park this, top it off with water. Then we'll go fill that feed wagon. Okay. Yeah, so I guess we'll just park this right over here. And we'll hop in the case. And we will go over by the Kubota. And start filling this thing with cow food. Okay, so we are going to do that, so we can see what our fill levels are going to be. And let's go grab that Kubota. Okay. So I hope I get this right. I know you got to get the mixtures a certain way. So we're going to need hay, silage, straw, and mineral feed. All right. Well, we're going to need hay and straw. It's going to be the two main factors. Oh, I'm no, not hay. no hay and silage. So let's grab some silage. Hope I don't want all of those. Okay.
cares. Yep. Okay, well that sure took a lot. So we're gonna put this down. Not the best angle. Let's see if we get a better view here. No, not too, not too good. That's as high as it goes, too. That yeah, should be all right. Oh yeah, we're good. We'll get better at this as we do it more. Okay, so we're going to. Oop. Okay, I think that's good. Actually, you know what? I don't think we're giving it enough. I think we need to put the whole bill in there. Let's see. Oh, yeah. I, it's barely showing anything. Okay. See, we live, we learn. We learn it as we go. So I'm going to dump this whole thing in there. So if we need a bigger uh, front loader, it doesn't really... Uh, want to come off. Come on. There we go. Hope that'll work. Yep. So let's go back to the silage. Okay, we'll put that one in there. Alright, sorry this is taking so long, guys. Dump that one in. Good. So now we want straw. And that's over here. Okay. Let's grab, well, let's we'll grab the small one right here. That'll work. Okay, so we'll go put this in there and then we'll do some mineral feed. So now the mineral feeds over there on the pallets. And it looks like we need more silage, don't we? Okay, little by little. All right, guys, we got the mixture right. Took a little trial and error, but we got it. So now, let's go feed these cows. Well, 
good to go. Alright guys, well, that looks like our daily chores are done, so uh, I guess in the next episode we'll uh, go up in that helicopter and take a look around. Alright, thanks for joining me guys, see you later.